Okay, bye. She's gonna drink you under the table, bro. She's got I mean, your experience. She, she also looks like she's a pirate, like she can't beat your ass. Yo, hide. Here's someone behind me. Wonder who that could be. It's probably <laughs> Denono. I mean, I already did his voice and everything. What's up, man? You here for some more grub? No, I was just escorting someone to the restaurant. Escorting? What are you talking about? The old lady from 212. Her name's Helen. She asked me to help her down here. Check you out, Kyle Hyde, savior of the elderly. You bet your sweet Shut ass. Shut your fucking mouth, Louie. I just did your job for you. Shut your head. Right. Thanks for the solid. Hey, check this, Hyde. Boosted this up off the floor of the restaurant. It was right under your table, man. It's your pen, right? I mean, it was under your table and all. It's not, okay. but I'm gonna take it. Ba -na -na -na. I take a fountain pen from Louie. Nope, not mine. Really? I mean, really? Figured it had to be yours, man. That's harsh. Wonder who it belongs to. Look here. There are words carved into the body of the pen. If only you could read, Louis. <laughs> oh, hey! You're right, my man. But it's worn down and all the ink's gone. I can't read. <laughs> I can't either. Louis? Louis? The no, no. I need your help right now. Get in here. Chop, chop. Great. Mama Sass is on my case again. Better go see what she wants now. Good thinking. Louis runs off towards the kitchen. <laughs> Wonder how I can read this engraving. Let's do that chop thing, right? That all those detectives do. Feel <laughs> <Give a> shit. <gasps> a star. There's a sticker on the podium. Minus eleven. Uh, I'm assuming that we have to get seven more, because there's seven, and the restaurant's called Seven Stars, right? Maybe the last one's in the bar. That would make sense, actually. Cool. Uh, do, 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 do. Bad. And the code's thing? unique to each game, because it, like, randomizes the numbers. I'm thinking the back and pen belongs to Summers, because he was at our room. Let's go back to our room, then. I'm gonna try and search the box for the bookmark, Wait. and then... There's a board outside the restaurant that has chalk. Okay. <laughs> we'll go get the bookmark, so... <laughs> We're already here. <laughs> There's a cardboard box on the bed. Products oh, sent over are still in the box. Wrong box. Fuck that. Other box. Cardboard box on the bed. Box is empty. Maybe it's in like the creases? Can we use an item on it? This is where I'll be sleeping. Bed's a bed, I guess. Okay. Corporate box on the bed. Box is empty. Well. I don't know what else to tell you. Oh, uh, it looks like we can't do that until later. Well. So let's go get the chalk. <laughs> Fuck me, I guess. Dun. 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 I'm assuming chalkboard. There's a chalkboard near the entrance to the restaurant. There's some chalk lying below the board. Yeah. A couple of pieces of chalk. And we have. Can I use the pen on the chalk? There's a piece of chalk here. 
There's some chalk powder here too. Here we go. Put a little of it on my finger. Get it in. What's the quick save button again? Uh, it's save state. Yeah. Shift. Shift it. Bonk. Yeah. Is this one of the ones where you have to blow? Um, if it is, we might have a bit of a problem. Well, I know you can set it up. I know. That's like the white noise. No, we're good. With love. Riveting. <laughs> to okay, to Alan with love. To Alan Rickman with love. Oh my God, it does look like a pin for Snape. Alan Rickman was here. To Alan Rickman with love. Alan Rickman, who's Alan Rickman? I dare you not know. Maybe Louis does. <laughs> Louis is not a Harry Potter fan. Hey. Hey, Louie. I read the writing on the pen. You did? So what's it say, man? To Alan Rickman with love. Alan Rickman? Yeah. Anyone staying here tonight named Alan Rickman? I don't know. I'll have to check it with the old man Dunning. Do it! I want to find who owns this pen. Hold on, do it for a bit, will ya? Sure, man. Goodbye. Okay, Goodbye, okay, thanks. We can go return that doll to that small child. Yeah, that's- oh yeah, yeah. Melissa's doll. I almost forgot about that. And she's in this room. With the doc- what did the doctor answer? <laughs> what are you doing here? Stop passing on my child. <laughs> oh, it's you. <laughs> Got a sec, kid. My dad's not here. Okay. <laughs> I'm here to you see you. Again? What? You, you forgot something in the restaurant? Yeah. This is yours, right? Oh. It's okay, I take it. Thank you. My mom made this. Must be pretty important to you. Uh-huh. Is that why you got upset? Then maybe you shouldn't throw it at people. <laughs> okay, sorry. Where'd your dad go? Where'd your ombre go? Where'd your old man run off to? I dunno. I've been a brat. Oh. I'm sure he went somewhere so he didn't have to see me anymore. Oh he shit! Hates me. <laughs> I guess that's correct. I doubt that. Yeah, but he's always all mad at me and stuff. Parents have to keep their kids in line. It's part of the job. Part of the job? Don't worry about it. See you around. Mm. What? Don't... Don't go, please. Just stay here until my dad gets back. What? Listen, kid, I'm not a babysitter. Come on, please! Oh, fine. This doesn't look weird at all if we're in the apartment alone with her. Room 219. And the father comes back and is like, what the fuck are you doing in here? He's sick today, so he's been home from school. Melissa? I know, let's do a puzzle! I don't like puzzles. Oh fuck no, I know how this goes. Uh, the puzzle's on the table. Let's play over there. <laughs> Sounds demented now. <laughs> um, Dad? Dad? 
The puzzle, Dad. The puzzle, Dad. <laughs> um, your dad's just asshole. Snoop remember? Real quick. It's a brochure. It's a hotel brochure. Same one I have. Next to the refrigerator is a small cabinet. Let's take it's a the little shit. fridge under the TV. Maybe I'll raid it later. <laughs> TV's been turned off. Okay. We need to inspect the bathroom or something. We inspect Perhaps. something. There's the puzzle. We'll leave that for a sec. Pillow. I guess there's nothing special about this bed. You never know. I see a couple of small lamps on either side of the bed. It's an oil painting on the wall. Whack. Is that a beer? It's a phone next to the bed. Now Melissa can make prank calls. There's an empty soda can on the table. There's a cup on the table. Okay. Yes. Wow. Little soaps and stuff. Bottle of shampoo. Towels are clean. Sinks clean. Mirror's been cleaned. Roses work, no doubt. All this shit's clean, and there's nothing for me to even, you know, look at. So bye. Well, do your stupid puzzle. Just because I'm a sucker for puzzles. Yeah. Let puzzles. The frame on the wall. Okay. It's a puzzle box. Da -da 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 -da. It's a jigsaw puzzle on the table. Ooh, baby. Isn't this the same one? Yeah, but remember she broke it? Well, I guess. But... Where's the corner pieces? There's a corner piece. But where's, like, the corner corner pieces? There's one There's right. one. Ah. There's one here. No, this one. So that goes there, I guess. Huh. Eh. I do eh. No. Eh. And, uh, eh. You're a master puzzle solver. Uh. I'm just looking for the corner pieces. I just want the corner pieces. I just, I like to do this. Don't we have like a piece in our inventory because she threw it? I think we gave that back. Did we? I don't remember. Terrible. I guess if we didn't, it'll be like, hey, remember that fucking puzzle piece you have in your inventory? Terry's playing with my narcotics. Uh, that's not good. <laughs> I know. Here you go, kitty. I know this. Here makes you sense. go, small kitten. I know this messes up my, me. I wonder what happens to you. It's a valid question to ask. <laughs> um. Oh, yeah, that's fine. I thought that his diaper was like the fur on his belly, so I was like, wait, no. Isn't that what happened last time we tried to put the possum together? <laughs> I don't have no idea. Do you go? You do? You do you even lift, Master Wayne? <laughs> Master Wayne! And then, uh... I put that there. Then we gotta put this somewhere. Probably there. And then we put that there. And then we put that there. And then we put that there. I did it! <laughs> Got it! Genius! Wow! Oh my gosh, you're so great! He looks so satisfied with himself. That was so- it was too easy for you, wasn't it, mister? A little. Hey, Squirt, you know the name of the rabbit on this puzzle? Um, Mr. Rabbit? Nope! <laughs> Bet you made that up. Yeah. Well, if you care, 
The rabbit's real name is Pinky Rabbit. Pinky Rabbit? That's right. Pinky had his own cartoon when I was growing up. I bet your mom watched it when she was a kid, too. When my mom was a kid? Yeah, your mom and dad were kids once, too. Everybody starts out as a kid, you know. Yeah, I guess. My mom gave this to me for my birthday. Yeah, when's your birthday? June 29th. June, huh? So, was your birthday fun? No. What? What is it? That's the day my mom left, so... Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Let's go. Why do you think my mom... Why do you think she never said anything, huh? Why? Why? Why'd she go away? Oh. Wait a minute. On the back of that puzzle piece. Hey, na -na -na. So, now that I remember this, this is where I got stuck. Because you have to somehow make it to, like, in this case, you have to actually close the DS and reopen it. Okay. Lid. Bonk. Bonk. I did it! Goodbye, Melissa. That's morbid as fuck! There's a message written on the back of the puzzle. Same. Goodbye, Melissa. If she wrote this, she wasn't planning on coming home. That's really sad. <gasps> Nah. Oh, that's me. <laughs> I was like, why are you Mr. Hard? What are you doing here, alone in my apartment with my tiny child? We were playing. Mm. <laughs> I told you not to let anyone into our room, Melissa. <laughs> hey. Don't yell at the kid. Pardon me, but I had... had quite enough of. I let myself in. She didn't do anything wrong. Sorry, didn't mean to step on any toes. Well, as long as you know how I feel, I guess there's no problem other than you being an adult. Coming into my apartment, small child. Whoops. Now please leave. Please vacate the premises promptly. Yeah, I'm going, but... Let me ask you something. Why is that one gray? Uh... I don't know, maybe it means that we can't ask him? Should I even ask any of these? Why did your wife leave? Huh? Uh... It said... Ask him, you worried about Melissa? You worried about something Melissa may have told me? Well, specifically, I was wondering if you talked to her about her mother. If you didn't talk about anything in particular, that's fine, too. We had a discussion about a puzzle. Why are you asking about her mom? What's the story with the kid's mom? Is it that she's not coming home? What? Oh shit, found out. Melissa, what have you been telling Mr. Hard about your mother? Um... Damn it! Damn it all! Um... Stop, what do you mean? Mr. Hard... Every family has its own circumstances, which dictate it, its existence. Your knowledge of my family comes from the mouth of a child who loves her mother. Please remember that when drawing conclusions and passing judgment. And I'm not judging. I didn't pass any judgment, though. Okay. Why did your wife leave? I feel like he's gonna get angry at us and throw us out. 
Well, if we had asked that first, it looks like he would have gotten angry. So why did the kid's mom leave? Pardon? Wife left you, right? L L left me. <laughs> what did you do? I mean, why'd she take off and leave you and the kid and... Uh... I guess we we'll press him, right? You have to say what he says, though. Oh. Mr. Hard, this isn't the place to talk about this. Hey, dude. Easy, right? Easy, pal. No need to get in the lather. Mm -mm -mm. You're gonna scare Melissa. Keep your voice down. What? I think you're scaring the kid. Oh. Your daughter. Dad, I'm scared. Melissa. Don't look at me like that. I didn't... I'm sorry. Fuck you. Kyle's a better dad. Mr. Hard, I'm going to ask you to leave now. 